Yo, what is up, you guys? It is your boy Itachi. Today, we are going to be making a video that I have been waiting to do for a long time because of Christmas. Um, it was absolutely crazy at my house. I hope you all had a good um, Christmas too. I hope you all um, had saw family that you haven't seen in a while. I hope you all had a got what you want from Santa. You know, I have a, I have a lot of young people out there, and I hope everyone got what they wanted for Christmas. But this is a video that has been long in the making. Um, currently, right now, it is 12 20, 29, 2020. We're almost to New Year's, where we're going to be in the year 2023. Man, it feels so weird saying that. Because only like a couple years ago, we were in 2019, 2018. Which kind of sounded like a few, like we we're in a futuristic movie. But um, this video is very important to our channel to the dedication that we've made to our channel and for all of you guys and to me and to future me if future me sees this in a few years and um hopefully i'm doing youtube um by then uh, right now i'm recording off of my um a computer that well it's called a and I'm not, I'm not trying to brag or anything, okay? I'm not trying to make anyone feel hurt. You know, I have a lot of sensible, a lot of sensitive people in here. But, you know, I'm grateful for what I got for Christmas. My mom knew, my mom knew that um, I do YouTube videos. And my mom saw me recording off of my phone. Look at this. God of War. We, we completed God of War this year, guys. Come on now. You know, you know I love my boy Kratos. But, um, you know, I am. Um, I record off this and there's not a lot of storage you know what I mean on my on my phone so my mom got me and all my my uh, I think a couple of my family members got one um, a Microsoft Sun surface go 3 it's uh, like a tablet slash computer um, where you can hook up a mouse or whatever. But for right now, I got a pen. So I'm, I'm completely grateful with it. So I'm recording off of it. So now I can actually talk as long as I want and edit videos if I can find a, a free editing software. But side rant, okay? Side rant. Um, but, um, but anyway, let me get to the point. Um, today's video is about the channel, the birth of our channel. Today, well, December 25th, 2020, two years ago, on the 25th, we made our, I made our channel. The community that we know now as, as people know me as Itachi. As Itachi776. Um, I go, I went by many names before those two years. I changed my name like freaking millions of times before I actually got a name that actually I was comfortable with and I, and I changed it up. Um, I made my first name for this channel was actually Puppet Boy 14, which was my first ever name for my TikTok, which I had in 2018 on my TikTok channel, and people knew me as Puppet Boy all the way to 2022 to now before my account got banned. Then I switched my name to Anonymous. So if you guys have been around for a long time on my channel, you probably know these names, but if you, you're just new, you, you guys probably won't. Um, my name was Anonymous underscore or Anonymous underscore 776 or Anonymous underscore 14. And then I changed my name to Spider Boy 776 or Spider Boy for short. Then I was getting like when people searched up my name, it was like people were seeing Spider Man clips and junk. So I just had to change it. Then we got the name that we have now, Itachi776, or shortly for Itachi. So people only know me, people know me as Puppet Boy, people know me as Itachi. So if you ever guys ever see some comments with, hey, yo, Itachi, love the video, or yo, Puppet, love the video, or yo, Spider, love the video. There's a lot of people that watch my videos from back in the day when I did it two years ago. Um... I just want to say, um, let me get to the point. I just want to say how proud I am of myself. Um, <clears throat> how proud I am of myself. I want to say how proud I am of keeping my head up. You know, I know past me was 
um, never showed my face. I only did um, edits, music edits. I started with music edits and I started with memes, creating memes and stuff like that and posting them, never getting any views except for doing Corey Kenshin um, re um, music remakes and this and that. Ooh, didn't want to yawn on camera. I was about to pause it. And then I get, got brave and I was just like, okay, I just don't, I, I, I got brave and I was just like, listen, I don't just want to, I just don't want to um, just do music edits. I want to communicate. I want to be with my people. I want to talk to my people. I want to, you know, be with my people. You know what I mean? Be with my subscribers or the people that could know who I am. So when I started, I erased everything i wiped everything off i wiped everything away my edits my shorts my everything and i started brand new i got me a profile picture i got a whole bunch of new stuff um my new my new video my new videos from when i started again was my i show speed reaction and then i had a minecraft a fallout 70 fallout 4 video or something like that i can't remember and then i started my way up and then hmm I did a reaction video, did reaction videos, where I would have a mask, where, I don't know where the mask has been, it's been a few, it's been a few months since I wore the mask, since I took it off, and I wore the mask, every video, every reaction video I did, until I got comfortable to, to the point where I got comfortable that, um, I would show my face, um, I did sailing, my sailing vlogs where I worked with, uh, boats, um, where I do my summer job at. And hopefully by next year I can do vlogs, um, work vlogs at my job. Damn, sorry, I had to yawn. Um, where I did vlogs and stuff and I still, like, kept the mask. And there was one video, there was one part of the video where, I did an overlay on CapCut, like if you don't know what CapCut is, it's an editing site where you can edit clips and shorts and whatever. A lot of TikTokers know what that is, like Call Me Chris and a few other people know what, what that is. And I used it and I put a picture of a, a Yakotsky mask um, covering the, the original video to cover my full face because I didn't want anyone to see who I was. So I accidentally, it glitched. And it made my face show. It showed my face the entire time. So it was already public. People already saw who I was. And there was a lot of people that were like, yo, this is, uh, you know, people commenting, yo, face reveal, um, Itachi face reveal. You know what I mean? Or no, at the time I was like, Spider Boy. It was like, Spider Boy uh, face reveal. And people, thousands, uh, all my subscribers were like, yo, he face revealed himself in the video. I don't think he meant to do that. But people already knew who I was, so I was just like, okay, so people know where I am. <laughs> Screw it. So I said, okay, you know what? I'm taking off the mask. I took off the mask, and I did my first ever vlog, which was called, I think it was called the Amazon Wishlist. Don't remember. I think it was called, like, Vlog 4, Vlog 5 or something. Dang, I don't know why I'm yawning. Um, I think it was called Vlog 5, Vlog 4, whatever, and it had like an Amazon logo, it had um, something else, and it had a ring light in the middle of it, because that's when I had got my ring light from Amazon, and I got, I think I got like something else in my phone case, in my waterproof phone case, and I did an unboxing in it. And, you know, a lot of people didn't comment after I face revealed myself, it was almost like a freaking dream face reveal. Um... A lot of people didn't stay with me on my channel after I revealed myself. A lot of people did stay, and I have a whole bunch of people. But since then, I have gained over 574 subscribers. And I'm eternally grateful, and I'm very grateful for all of you guys that subscribe. Um, I've met many people. I have talked with many people, many subscribers. And let me tell you something, I love the community that we've made. I I love the community that we made together. Um, even though that the, I have a lot of young people that can't really have social media, this, that, and the third. But if you comment on the videos or people that um, don't have YouTube accounts or whatever. Um, I made a video with, it was called Omegle Trolling Video. And uh, I was just going... I was just doing some stuff on Omegle, pranking people on Omegle, and then this kid was like, 
um, this kid recognized me for the first time, my first ever recognized time. Um, the first time anyone has ever recognized me, and the guy, the kid knew me from when I was Spider Boy, and I was just like, dang, like people actually see my videos. And he loved it. He said he loved my content so much. He loved it. This, then, the third. After the, it, I, I edited it because it was a really long conversation, and I cut in, I deleted it because I had like a lot more, a freaking a lot more um videos, and also too, I recorded off of my computer that didn't have a lot of storage so you can only have an a little bit a limited amount of time you can um edit your videos or amount of time that you can have in your videos so i had to clip all that out and just throw it away so i had to clip it out but the kid was just like listen i love your videos i love your content i watched your videos when you made the atachi um edit which i still have now um i loved your cory catching edits and um and he was just like, yo, I just, I can't believe I got to meet you, this, that, and the third. And I was just like, no problem. Uh, just have a nice day. You know what I mean? I'll, I'm never rude to people. I'm never rude to my, my, my subscribers. You know what I mean? Because one day, that one person that says, oh, you're my hero. One day, if someone says, oh, you're my hero, you're my, you're my, um, you're like my, my role model. You just don't, people like to ignore that and think that it's fake. It's not. If people are saying that you're their role model and you're their, um celebrity hero or something and they say this in your comments you can't just ignore it you have to take it you know what i mean but and i would like to thank everyone has been with my channel um luke um connor lots of people that have been in my channel for years um there's a lot of videos when i make game videos um, when I make my gaming videos, I get kind of mostly good um, views. I don't know if the, anyone's going to see this, but, um, I don't think anyone's going to see this, but until future me, unless future me see this or future subscribers see this, but, um, you know, it, it's good to see where I started to go, to go and see where I started to, to see where I came now, you know what I mean? It's it's a dream that I've had since I was little. And I've said this in multiple videos. I've said this in vlogs, talk vlogs, this, that. And um, I've said that it's been a dream since I was little. A dream since I was the little kid to become a YouTuber. And if this is like what, and if this is what I really want to do, I'm going to keep doing it. No matter if I have to get a job. And no matter if I get older and I have to get a job, um, a job and then still do YouTube. Or if I don't have to have a job and do YouTube, um, I really want this to be my real job one day. But um, I just want to say that the community that we make, that we're making, could could make people's lives better. And I and I just don't mean it like make people's lives better. Um, reason why I got into filming and stuff is um because of Corey Kenshin. Corey Kenshin, if you're watching this, if you see this, man, um, um, when I had medical problems going on with me in my life, um, in the year 2021, um, I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease. It's when the cells in your stomach, uh, when you eat, like normal people, when they eat, when normal people eat, their cells in your tubes in your stomach that tell say hey you need to grind up this food so you know you can pass it on to the toilet you know what i mean and but i didn't have that my my cells weren't programmed to to do that so i had to take medication on top of medication on top of medication on top of medication medication that would make me sick medication that would make me sleep medication that that would make me feel sick and make me feel like i was on the on the ground and um feeling like i need to vomit most of the time and, you know, most of the time I would lay on my couch just wishing that I, I didn't have this. And, and, you know, I went through this my all two years, you know, a year going through this. And uh, just this year, just now, um, we went to a doctor and we, um, and they diagnosed me again. But the, um, this guy is having me take shots, had me take shots to put in my leg. And... 
hopefully in a few years the the thing can can go away but I don't know but I didn't really want to put my personal life on there but there's a lot of people that are like um is I stepped away from YouTube for a little bit because of my medical problems um that and other personal problems that I've been having in my life um my medical problems have been the most the most effective the most effect on put the most effect on my YouTube channel because when I got sick I didn't want to do anything I didn't want to go to school I didn't want to do anything I didn't even want to go outside I didn't want to play video games and that's not like me I have freaking video games I have video I have my Xbox over there I have my TV I got my boy Itachi back there I have my whole yes the rooms can pink I have all my games and all my movies over there. You got Dragon Ball Z, Fluffy. I'll do a story time later on that. I have my animes over there. This, the old, um, the old, um, kung fu movie, movies from the seventies or something. I love old vintage movies, and I just didn't want to do anything. You know what I mean? I just didn't want to do anything. And when I stopped taking the medicine, it kind of made me feel a little no normal. Feel it made me feel a little bit normal. Um, so I just started making videos. I just started launching, just freaking, just launching videos, you know what I mean? But the only effect, the only person that got me doing that was Corey Kenshin because there was a video that said, um, anything's possible or something. It was something in the summertime he posted, uh, something about, he heard a family, one of his family members said that, um, he couldn't achieve college or something. He couldn't be an astronaut or whatever. And he said that if you have a dream and you really want to achieve it, do it. Don't let anyone stop you. And that's what I say all the time to people. If you have a dream and you really want to achieve it, do it. Don't let anyone. All the haters are going to hate you. There's going to be haters. There's going to be haters in normal life, in the normal life. I'm only, I'm about to be 16. Two years from now, I'm probably going to be on my own, living on, on my own. You know what I mean? I'm going to understand that there are haters in this world. There are people that are going to hate you because you got a you get you got a car, you got a house, you live by yourself, you can provide food and water and shelter for yourself. You can you have money, you you got the proper education. But the thing is is that people are there's, there's haters and there's jealous people. There are jealous people in this world because either because things that have happened in their in their life in their life as a kid or they just they're just jealous for no reason but i just don't want to get into that um but core kenshin you had a really big impact on my life um every day that um i would be sick i would every time that i would see your videos I, one day i was just so sad man i wouldn't i wouldn't laugh i wouldn't do anything i was just tired but when i saw your notification on my phone i freaking clicked that button so fast and i was just like Every time that I see a video now, even look, I got spooky, scary Sunday merch, spooky, scary Sunday merch. That's how much I love your channel. And I love you, bro. Pause. Um, I know you probably get this all the time. Probably get this all the time. Um, but you know, I'm not, I'm a big, <laughs> I'm not, I'm, go, I'm going fanboy mode now, but, uh, but sometimes, sorry, the video had to stop. But, um, I think the point I'm trying to say is, you know, there's, um, always that one person that's helping you in your life. And what I'm trying to say is I'm just so happy. I'm happy that I've made it this far. I'm happy through all the things that, um, that, um, I'm just so happy through all out, throughout all the things that have happened through my life. I can still try and achieve my dream and I'm grateful and I'm, and I'm, I'm blessed to be alive because there was a point in my life that I didn't think I could live anymore. And that's the truth. And, you know, it's, you know, we go through hard times all the time. But there's a lot of people that go through really, really, really hard times. Worse hard times than anyone could ever think of. And they can still live. And sometimes they give up. And they just end it. And I don't, I'm not, I don't mean end it. Like, I mean really end it. And those people end it all. You know what I mean? They end socializing with people. They end their seeing their families. They end everything because of it. 
but I just want to say that I stuck through it, that I, I, I'm glad. And if you guys have been through things in your life that a hard time in your life that you've gone through, I'm, I'm, I'm glad that you've gone through. And if you're going through a hard time right now, I hope, and I pray to God, I pray that you are, you can get through it. And I know that you can get through it. And if, and if you think that there's no purpose in life to live or there's no purpose in you doing anything, there is a purpose. I know that there's a purpose because I know that I'm not just doing YouTube just to do YouTube. It's to achieve my dream and this is what I want to do. And this is my purpose. For some reason, I could, when I first did editing, I felt like I've done it, but I did it before. I felt like I, I knew what to do. I, I felt like I knew how to edit already. I felt like I already did it. Find your thing that makes you you. Find it. Whether it be swimming, join the swimming team, join a soccer team, join the computer club, join a karate fighting team, join a UFC team, join an MMA, MMA fighting team, watch anime, make animations, create art, do something. You know what I mean? Whatever makes you happy and you want to pursue it as a career and use it as a job or make it as your own business or designing, designing, becoming a mechanic, becoming a gaming person, creating your own video game because um, I want to create my own video games, but also too, I want to become a YouTuber. So I can't be doing all the same thing, but YouTubing is on the high end, you know what I mean? On, on the top, you know what I mean? Um, it's on the top. Um, but I just want to say how grateful I am for all of you guys. Um, and if I don't make a New Year's video, it's probably, I'm probably not going to make a New Year's video. I might make a New Year's vlog. It just depends how crazy my, my New Year's night is. Um, but, um, I just want to say how grateful I am for all you guys. And I just want to say how grateful I am that God blessed me with such great people on my channel. And, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Enjoy this video. I hope you guys go and enjoy all my videos. And I hope people enjoy my videos in the year 2023 and i will see all my you know what we're gonna make something we're gonna do something um my names for you guys i don't know ikatsuki members sound a little weird you know they are villains in the in the movie you know my name is itachi so i you know ikatsuki members feel a little bit eh, because people some people anime people hate the ikatsuki so i'm just gonna call you my saiyans because that's what you are. The Saiyans, we are the most strongest family out here. We are the most strongest, the most powerful, the most powerful people on YouTube. And if we just stick together and if we stay together, together as a family, as a YouTube family, we can become that huge, big, strong group. So all my Super Saiyans out there, and if you don't know what Super Saiyans are, go and Google Young Culture Swine. But... All my Super Saiyans out there, I hope you all have, if I don't make a video on New Year's, I hope you all have a great New Year's. I hope you all have a great year, and I will see you either guys on New Year's or after New Year's, or I'll see you guys in 2023. Peace.